episode of Deep Fried What? We got us some sherries, bitches! First thing we gotta do is make us some batter. Oh, and I'm gonna drink Pink's fucking chelada that he bitched out on earlier. Hey, fuck you. Uh, <laughs> I won, I'm the winner. Uh, Dunker Games. One pound T-bone <laughs> steak. <laughs> Let's do it. Three, two, one. Oh, it went. Oh, yeah, that was a good shot. It's like you're deep frying Australia. That, this is pretty much <laughs> the test of Sherry's is, is it better than, than Denny's? Yeah. We're finding out today, folks. It does look like Antarctica. And you know, while I'm here, the steak did come with some sides, so. What kind of sides? We got some hash browns and some scrambled eggs. We're gonna make a hash brown ball. Let the batter slip through your fingers. <laughs> your fingers aren't even in there. How dare you? Oh, get in there. oh God. <laughs> it's gonna marry with that steak now. Oh, oh, oh. It's not angry. It's angry. These just fell apart. Oh no. My hush puppy. Oh no. My hush puppy. Maybe we should have egg washed it first. Yeah. Oh god. <laughs> That's a pound of steak. Yay! Look at it! Oh, that looks awesome! This is an extremely juicy, juicy steak. That's good. Maybe. I think that means it might have actually been cooked properly. All right, fuck the knife. Let's do this cold moose style. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, How did you ask for that? Like, what? Rare. You asked for it rare. Okay. I picked their rarest option, and this thing, you could already tell when you were looking at it, was medium at best. I mean, it was gray. You know, it's like, how did that get cooked? Um, It's not seasoned at all. Oh. It tastes like jerky that's been soaking in water. Oh no. Rehydrated even? Uh-huh. Oh. It tastes like canned meat. Oh no. Really? Uh-huh. The best part of that's the batter. <laughs> oh boy, that's bad. Batter has excellent seasoning. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Steak, not so much. Bless your, uh... It's overdone. Not so great. Let's try some... Uh, Trash browns. Yay, trash browns. Oh, that doesn't look like a good phase. Extra fried, already over fried hash browns <laughs> aren't super great. <laughs> Rome's favorite home layer. That guy right there. Mostly what Is you're saying. Is that how for. we're doing this? Dude, it's a fucking omelet. I okay. don't know any better. Why don't you wrap it in that pancake? Oh! Oh! Okay! Pancake sandwich. Hmm. Yep. Drip through my fingers. It's dripping through the fingers. It's dripping off the fingers. Yes. Careful with your fingers, baby. <laughs> Surprisingly enough, it didn't stick together. <laughs> Do I see doubt? Do I see a hint of doubt here? This is why Good Mythical Morning has a lot more subscribers. Ah! No, it isn't. God damn it. It looks like a portobello mushroom now. That thing has like eight ounces at least. Oh, okay. All right. Here we go. There is the second mass. There we go. That's the other Wait, half of it. Is the other pancake in there? Yeah, that's... that's this. Oh my god, it looks like a face hugger is, is keeping the pancake yeah. on the omelet. There we go. I made a, I made an omelet. Sandwich. Who else sees that? In the comments, comment right now. Is that fucking a face hugger on that pancake? Oh yeah, put that honey on there. Get that all up and in there. <laughs> yeah, assume the guy Fieri stance. <laughs> He's really hot still. <laughs> It 
tastes exactly like what you're eating. There's pancakes. And there's an omelet in there. Good God, it's just greasy, but it's still <laughs> so fucking delicious at the same time. But it's not, like, super fantastic. Mm-hmm. Like, it is what it is. I guess cherries, you know? Yeah. You're happy to have it because it's open at 3 o'clock in the morning. <laughs> yeah, I mean, and, and, like, I mean, like, I'm getting all the flavors and the things. I mean, like, it is what you would expect it to be. I'm just gonna have to go with a check on this one because, like, like the deep frying doesn't necessarily elevate it, but mm. it doesn't make it any worse. Mm -hmm. Sherry's apple pie. You can see the sugar crystals on top. Mm -hmm. That's impressive. I like that. I like that presentation. Here comes the pie boy. It's mostly solid. It is. Yeah, I can tell it's very cold. And just came out of the freezer, I'd imagine. Because that's what we do here at Colt Moo. <laughs> Don't ask us if we've frozen it first. We have. I guarantee it. I witness every single freezing. It's a wonderful day for pie. Woo! <clears throat> Yikes, that went right to the bottom. It's time for French toast. So the French toast actually came as a side to the steak. Okay. Uh, but I I don't want to ruin the French toast by trying to deep fry that with the steak. So Lofi's gonna try it with his pie. That bread sometimes turns out pretty good, and Lofi is the he is the master of breads. I make my own loaves. <laughs> you heard that? Sacre bleu! All right. Love it. I can't even tell where I grabbed it. Get it out! Let's try. That looks good. Let me have my tasty try. Fuck, what is that? And where did it come from? No, this is my work shirt, god damn it. Okay, hi. <laughs> French toast and apple pie. Here we go, Sherry's, thank you. <laughs> oh, oh my. Mmm. 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 Oh, that makes me so happy. Oh my god, this is so good. And the Johnny's on top really pulls it together. It's just a nice little touch, but it's it's just the, the little bit to get you across the finish line. You know what I'm saying? And it's so good. Oh fuck. Okay, so the apples are really tangy, and that does this a lot of uh, good service. The apple pie filling in there is, is very flavorful. It's very sugary. And that really contrasts against the tartness of the apple. And the deep fry treatment on this especially is the star player. Like... It's like you got an extra thick McDonald's hand pie. Hand pie. It, uh, but you also um, were just able to get like a lot of really great saltiness on the top of it. And it's, it's so good. It's so absolutely humbling, this apple pie. Well, let's see how it goes after deep frying with a little bit of maple syrup on it. Here we go, cheers. All right, so it's definitely okay, but there's some extra baggage here on top of regular French toast. And if it were just regular French toast, it would be the um, egg drenching and the toast and the maple syrup. The extra deep frying just puts a little bit of extra carbs on it that I don't think belong with the balance of just the egg washing um, bread and uh, maple syrup. Marion Berry Pie. Ah! Oh. oh. That's a thick bitch. Oh no. <laughs> that's a thick bitch. Well, that's where he lives now. <laughs> oh my. This thing weighs nine pounds. 
Lovely. It's more oil than pie now. Pretty sure, yeah. <laughs> that thing exploded in an interesting manner. This is good. Like, I love Marion Berries. If you know what a Marion Barry is, it's a DC uh, mayor. <laughs> but he makes great pies. I know they're gonna ask, so it is somewhere between a blackberry and a raspberry. That's what Marion Barry tastes like. It is literally the combination of the two. Mm. That is what makes a Marion Barry. Pretty sure. I looked it up like once or twice. Pretty <laughs> sure that's what Wikipedia says. <laughs> but uh, yeah, no, this 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 fiasco is delicious. Pecan pie. Holy shit, that's pecan? That's what they said. Look at it. it why, why is that so glorious? What is this frosting and shit? I think it's more whipped cream than pecans. Yeah, I want to go. So I know this shit's just gonna fucking melt. Oh, so oh maybe we I'm, should keep part of that separate. No, I'm gonna keep it on the side and put it back on top. That's a great idea. Oh, there goes the pecan pie. I, have we deep fried a pecan pie before? <laughs> I feel like we yeah, have. Yeah, I think so. Didn't we do like Sarah Lee pies and stuff? Something like that. Something like that. But hey, can never have too much pecan pie in my yeah. opinion. We did like the little tiny guys. <laughs> Boom. Pecan pie do 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 pecan pie do 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 pecan pie do 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 pecan pie. This is a mess. This is a fucking mess. All right. Hey, you don't even like pecan pie. Yeah, shut your mouth. I like your white. Oh shit. Oh my god. I love your chocolate. Oh, what is that? Melty, gooey. What? <laughs> Melty, gooey, the void? Oh. That one looks fucking delicious. So there's a lot of good things going on here. I mean, there's a lot of good whipped cream. You get little pecan pieces. You get a lot of chocolate. The uh, deep fry treatment is really nice, actually, to go along with that. Nice. But I'm not actually getting pecan pie. <laughs> oh, what are you getting? All the toppings. <laughs> <laughs> I don't. Is there actually pecan pie in here, or is it just chocolatey mouche? Well, go back for another. Maybe you just kind of got a lot of the deep fry pocket. Dude, like, that looks like it's not pecan pie. Mm. I think at some point, this might have been a pecan pie. And then it... I think it did the sugar thing, you know? When you have that sugary filling and then you deep fry it, it kind of gets absorbed into the batter and the batter becomes, like, crispy. That's kind of what happened here. But then it also has... A ton of whipped cream and chocolate, so it's all it just got moist and gooey again. So, deep fried sherries. What did we learn today? Not a whole lot, except that maybe sherries is just uh, slightly better than Denny's. <laughs>